Hi, everybody. I'm still in the hospital. It's about... <coughs> Excuse me. It's about 5 in the morning. I just came to do my vitals. Um, I came in on Tuesday. It's been Thanksgiving here, and it's now Friday. And, um... Everything went well. They cut the lap band out of my stomach. Um, I went into surgery about 2 o'clock, 2 something. And they cut the um, lap band out. He said there was a lot of scar tissue um, from the lap band being in my stomach from 2006. But he was able still to cut it out, cut the scar tissue out. As well as um, give me the gastric vertical sleeves, so I do have it. Um, this is what I've been drinking, eating. Um, that's water and um, Jello that they've been giving me. It's not that great. I uh, I don't know if you can see this. Uh, smirk here. Strawberry Jello, um, decaf black tea, and um, some low sodium broth is what I've been eating or trying to eat. The reason why I'm still here all these days is because again, I'm sorry they keep waking me up and I can't really sleep. Um, is because I can't keep anything down. So again, Tuesday evening, uh, two something, I got out of surgery maybe six thirty. My family said they saw me at like 6.50. I don't remember seeing them. I was out of it. Um, so if the nurses didn't tell me or my grandmother didn't tell me, I wouldn't even know they were here. Um, they're giving me medication for nausea. I got a, you, I don't know if you ever seen the people on a cruise ship or uh, for seasick. They put a patch behind my ear. They're giving me other uh, medication for nausea and pain. The only pain that I have, honestly, is a headache. Um, I'm moving around. I've walked around the hospital um, every day, four laps around. Um, I have that video. Also, my daughter was, took a Snapchat of me. I'm all over Snapchat, but... Um, so, I don't have any pain. Like, I, you know, excuse the uh, wording, but I'm able to clean myself, wipe my own behind and all that bend down. I haven't, they, you know, if I drop something, they're like, no, no, I'll get it, but I've been able to bend down. Um, it doesn't feel anything like the lap band. No uh, restriction of pulling. I guess it wouldn't be, because if the lap band, there's a port actually attached to your, the inside of your stomach, and with this, it's just your stomach muscles cut. Um, I have a picture of what they look like. It's like a, a little inch cut near my belly button. And two around the top. Um, so I'll insert that. But I don't know if I'm going home today. The goal is to not be nauseous when I go home. Um, so we'll see. Um, my family was mad at me. I drove myself here. So when the nurses told me that somebody was here, I guess they have this program where they text your family when you go in. And I put my grandmother's number and she brought my um, my mom, my aunt mom, uh, my aunt that raised me. <clears throat> help raise me with her or they she whatever they just both came and um then I got some flowers for my job flowers from um one of my best friends um Kia from Georgia some yellow roses and that was pretty cool and my kids came up um and that was pretty cool but right now I feel nauseous can't go back to sleep so I just made this quick video I wanted to Say it's Friday. I came in Tuesday and it's Friday and I'm still here. So I'm tired. But I'm not in pain. It's again, except for my head hurts, um, migraine. But I'm trying to sip more water. I don't, I'm not a big water drinker and I know that has to change. So they gave me <clears throat> this big water bottle from Yale and it has all of the uh, measurements. So this has been two days. I finally got it down. I'm pouring it into those cups and I have to monitor it. Um, <clears throat> the breathing. 
machine helps um you have to breathe into it and it helps uh open up your lungs after surgery so anytime you think about it you're supposed to do 10 matter of fact i'm gonna do it when i got this video 10 um <clears throat> an hour to take deep breaths and expand your lungs after surgery i have my um boots on stick my leg out sorry if this is too much for you my boots on to circulate. I can't even know if you can see it. Oh, so circulate um, your blood, and they're giving me shots in my arm for blood thinner. And I'm still walking, so I'm trying to do it all. I'm trying to listen. Um, I'm not gonna hold you. I did have <laughs> the night before surgery. I, you know, I, I, could, I was on a protein shakes. And they're giving me protein shakes here, too. It was a while. I forgot to mention that because I threw it in the garbage. But um, protein shakes for breakfast in one meal. And I was running around so much being a single mom trying to get my son situated. And I brought him to my daughter. And uh, <clears throat> I had a fish fillet from McDonald's and a four-piece nugget around 9 o'clock. And then that was it. Um, I lost uh, about seven pounds on that, on that uh, one meal a day, two protein shakes for a week or so and um he said my liver was okay um again the point of that is to shrink your liver so it can be easy to access he said it was okay a little bit fatty but it wasn't as bad as he's seen so at least he was able to do it um yeah that it wasn't hard it was just annoying um because of course you know i like to eat you know a food addiction i Eat when I'm happy, eat when I'm sad, eat <laughs> just because it tastes good. I'm like a foodie, but I'm just going to have to try to do different meals that I like, but in a healthier way. And I've been sitting here binge watching different videos and um, ideas about uh, the protein shakes, like a Thin Mint one. You put peppermint extract into the chocolate or um, hazelnut pump into the vanilla or, you know, just different things to spice it up. Cinnamon inside of um, a vanilla one. You know, just different things to do with protein shakes. Because I'm going to be on that for liquid diet for two weeks. And then when the doctor clears me, I'm supposed to go on a fifth. So when the doctor clears me, then I'll go to level two, which is puree. And then I think the puree stage is one week or two weeks. My paperwork is somewhere. And then after that, you go to uh, soft foods. So, like the ricotta bake and all of that. So, I've been looking at recipes and things like that. So, um, I just wanted to say hi. I hope everyone had a good holiday, Thanksgiving. And um, you had a good time with your family. So, I just wanted to say hi and check in. I still can't go live yet, but I think it's in a couple of more days. My 90 days should be up. So, all right. Thank you all for praying for me. I know I've got a lot of texts and um, inboxes, and I appreciate, I appreciate, appreciate everyone even thinking about me. <clears throat> so I wanted to say thank you. I'm thankful for that. <laughs> Just people that keep care, so you know. Thank you. All right, and have a good one.